I really do look like I'm addicted to meth, don't I? Boop! Well, hey you guys, I am late. I'm very late. Last week I wasn't able to make a video because I looked like a freaking fire ant and the sunburn I got at work to her from the week before it was all peely and nasty. Like, it's still kind of... Mm. It's on my face and ugh. So yeah, I'm still in my pajamas. But yes, this video is all about reminiscing. This is actually a tag video, and I was tagged by Tevin Technomana. Here's his channel here. He's a good friend of mine. He tagged me in this, and it's a high school reminiscing tag. But I didn't go to high school. I was homeschooled, and I still am. So then I thought, hey, I failed in that area, so let's go to elementary. I'll do that. But I was homeschooled in elementary too. So I figured, hey, let's go all the way back to kindergarten, and here we go. I, okay, and that was stupid, it's actually really heavy. Okay. I had to go through 500 million boxes to dig all this stuff out, so y'all need to appreciate me for the stuff I go through for you. Now I just look like a housewife in 1969. Okay, so here we go. Kindergarten reminiscing with Joey time. Na 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 na. Okay, here we go. What is all of this? I'm actually gonna tilt it down a bit so you all can see what's going on in the diddly do. I shouldn't have said that. One, two. I hit myself in the head. Oh, that's sharp as knives. It's a bunch of arts and crafts. I did nothing in kindergarten. The whole point of these videos was to like reminisce about all the achievements you've made, but I... There's not a whole lot of pride that comes with that. Well, okay, it is pretty great. Hey, Jules. Oh, here's baby Joey. Like, I know I look like a monkey, but I, it was really extreme when I was a kid. Look at those cheeks. I don't even know what that is. What? Whoa. There are hearts everywhere in here. I was a little romanticizer. And then I just turned into a mess. Well, that's a lot to take in. <coughs> he looks like a little potato head. Okay, that's actually pretty great. I made an armadillo or a turtle kangaroo. I don't, I can't tell from here. Wait, like, are these grades or something? Oh yeah, there's an F. I remember one time I actually got in trouble and that was the worst day of my life because I was, up till then, I was like the best kid in class. Like I was always do my work and ask questions and I would say things like please. But one time I, I got a little too crazy with my friends who clearly are not in my life anymore otherwise I would not be here. And there were like two places to go if you got punished and you'd know how much trouble you were in by which place she put you in. Like, the corner was the all right one, like, while well, you spilled your drink on somebody's face, like, goes in the corner. But we got too rowdy, so we had to sit behind the desk. All I wanted to do was cry and go home because I thought that they were gonna call the police on me. <laughs> and I, uh, it was really horrible because I, I'd never actually been in that much trouble before. So I didn't know what happened to kids who were being naughty in class. No one ever told me. <laughs> I wish I could have found like the signings I got. Like we got these signings at the end of the year. I would go around like getting all the signatures from all my classmates and stuff. And I remember one girl, her name was Jenny, and her and I were like Dorito buddies. Like all I remember is sharing my not sure she's Doritos with her and she'd give me like a lap dance. I don't remember. But yeah, we were we were homies. And I got her signature. And then there was my friend Chase. Like, we probably stayed in touch the longest. Then there's another kid who's obsessed with dinosaurs. I, I'm like half-assed looking through these. Okay, let's get down to business. Like, I just want to take a moment for you to appreciate this. That was my handwriting in kindergarten. It is very not that anymore. <laughs> Poor posture makes my body work harder. Yeah, well, sitting up straight makes you look like a pretentious asshole, so we don't need that. And here I demonstrate to you how the male sperm fertilizes the female egg. Oh, that's astronomy. Oh, this is a lot of fun. Oh, I cut myself again! Oh, I remember these. My mom would always have us do these, like, these logic problems where you solve, like, these puddle puzzles. 
And this one's like Edith, Francine, Hector, and Igor. I don't even want to know where the hell this is taking place. Place first, second, third, and fourth in the science fair. Their last names are Amwell, Boswell, Cross, and Drake. Find each person's full name and science fair rank. And then it just would give you clues and you'd have to figure it out. Like, I remember even thinking as a kid, ain't nobody even care about Francine and her stank ass. Oh, but yeah, I got an F on that problem. Oh, Francine. Harry Potter! Oh, we're almost done. It's really heating up in here. I got parrot cute. <laughs> what is all of it? Huh, idiot! Oh, we cannot talk about that. But well, is that it? I wish I had more stuff, but... Oh, yeah, I'm sweating like a pig in here. It, it's really hot. Thanks for sticking around with me. Thank you, Tevin, for tagging me in this. This is a lot of fun. Peace, house. <laughs> okay, um, so I guess I have to tag someone now. I'm going to tag Australian Young and Reflecting Pond. Yeah. Thanks for watching this week, guys. I love you guys so, so, so much. I'll see you guys next week. Be kind to those around you, and don't put your name into the goblet of fire unless you are of age. Yeah, I better get a big thumbs up for that Harry Potter reference, you ungrateful assholes. Peace, my crazy ass internet family.